Hello friends, let's find the real value of x. Let me put the question first. We have 3 raised to 9 plus x is equal to x raised to x. For this part, we will use a rule where a raised to b plus c, then it can be a raised to b times a raised to c. So, we can write this as 3 raised to 9 times 3 raised to x is equal to x raised to x. We will divide with 3 raised to x both the sides. So, these two get cancelled out. Now, we have 3 raised to 9 is equal to, now these two have same exponents. So, we can combine them. So, it will be x over 3 whole raised to x. Now, let's raise a power of 1 over 3 with the sides. So, it will be 3 raised to 9 whole raised to 1 over 3 is equal to x over 3 whole raised to x whole raised to 1 over 3. According this rule, if we have a raised to b whole raised to c, then it can be a raised to b times c. We can multiply this two and this two. So, it will be 3 raised to 9 over 3 is equal to x over 3 whole raised to x over 3. So, here 3 3s are 9. So, it will be 3 raised to 3 is equal to x over 3 whole raised to x over 3. Now, both the sides we have same base and exponent. Here we have 3 raised to 3 and here we have x over 3 whole raised to x over 3. So, we can equate power to power or base to base. So, it will be 3 is equal to x over 3. Multiply with 3 both the sides. So, these two get cancelled out. So, we have x is equal to 9 and this is our answer. Now, let us verify our answer. And our given question is 3 raised to 9 plus x is equal to x raised to x. Putting x is equal to 9. 3 raised to 9 plus 9 is equal to 9 raised to 9. Here we have 2 times 9. So, it will be 3 raised to 2 times 9 is equal to. This part can be written as 3 square whole raised to 9. 3 square is 9. So, we have 9 raised to 9 is equal to 9 raised to 9. So, x is equal to 9 is the right answer. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and we will meet in the next one. Bye-bye.